Hello every bot stallions, handsome Jack Boy here, bringing you guys a very special video in which I'm going to be showing you guys where all the broken down claptrap slash rescue missions are located in Borderlands 1. Now all of you guys should know about these little broken down claptraps. Um, they will uh, give you this quest uh, in which you have to find this little um, this like repair kit for them and if you find that repair kit and bring it back to them and turn it in they will uh, give you a uh, Backpack SDU, which a backpack SDU basically extends your inventory slots in Borderlands 1. So you can carry more weapons. So it's really cool, guys. That's like the only way to get those backpack SDUs. There is a couple other ways, but I'm not going to be talking about that in this video. So, yeah, I'm, not, I'm just gonna, going to be showing you guys where these uh, little clap traps are located. I'm not gonna, going to be showing you guys how to do the quest or where the uh, toolboxes are, the repair kits, sorry. Um, I'm not going to be showing you guys where those are located because it's pretty self-explanatory self-explanatory there's an objective marker that tells you where to go so anyway moving on here alrighty guys so there's a total of 10 claptrap rescue missions in borderlands 1 and the first one is located in sludge's safe house as you can see here on the right it's really easy to spot this is like the first one in the whole game that you can find uh, he's down this little hallway as you can see he's not there it's because I've already done this on my Roland I've done quite a bit of these uh, on my Roland here. I just wanted to get this done for you guys. I didn't want to have to do this on my other characters, but still, I'm showing you guys where they were originally at. And this claptrap opens up a door after you rescue him, which leads to a chest. The second claptrap is located in a lost cave, as you can see here on the radar. Now, this one is really easy to, to find, guys. He's basically right in your way, just kind of like in the last one. The last one, he w really wasn't in your way, but he was really easy to spot. But on this one, he's like right in your way, and he's like, you basically have to run into him if you go into lost caves so it's really easy to spot guys he doesn't open up any secret doors or anything that leads to chests or anything like that but nonetheless still pretty cool and he gives you a backpack SDU so moving on here okay guys so the third claptrap rescue mission is located in New Haven as you can see right there he's located right here this is definitely the easiest one to find and spot uh, because you know it's in New Haven and it's definitely the easiest one to complete like the quest and stuff because you don't have to find any enemy enemies but anyway after you complete it uh, claptrap will open up this little secret passage which contains a special chest Alrighty guys, so the next Claptrap rescue mission is located in Tetanus Warren. Now, this one once again is really easy to spot, just like the Lost Cave one. Uh, right when you enter the first big area, you know, if you're doing some side quests, uh, you'll fight some spider ants in here, and if you look to the left, bam, Claptrap will be right there. And, it's, you know, he's really easy to spot, guys. So, anyway, moving on here. Okay guys, so the next Claptrap rescue mission is located in Crazy Earl Scrapyard right here on the map. Now I actually didn't know about this one until like recently guys. As you can see, he's, the Claptrap still needs to be repaired. Um, it's because I've never actually known about this area over here in general. I didn't know there's a left path you can take right after you, uh, right after you pass Crazy Earl Cell. So it's pretty crazy, but as you can see, I'm showing you guys how to do this real fast. There's actually a quick way you can actually get this done. The toolbox is right up there. You can just jump on those little boxes and stuff, and bam, you get up there. Grab it, and bam, turn it in super fast. Re this one's like super easy to do. So anyway, moving on. Okay, so the sixth Claptrap rescue mission is located in Crom's Canyon right there. Now, um, I've already completed this one, of course. But, after, you know how after you complete these uh, little claptrap rescue missions, the claptrap actually, you know, roams around and stuff, but I couldn't find the claptrap, you know, I've been back here for a while and I couldn't find the claptrap, but right there, he's normally right there when he's, you know, needs to be repaired, but I finally figured out where the claptrap was, he was actually in here hiding all along, along with this uh, red chest, because I guess he opens up this little secret entrance which has this red chest, but he stays inside along with it, so it's kind of weird, but anyway, Moving on to the next uh, Claptrap Rescue Mission location. The seventh Claptrap Rescue Mission location is located right here in Trash Coast. Uh, as you guys saw back there on the map, um, this one's pretty easy to spot if you just um, go. If you once you go into Trash Coast, you can just take you know the right path and keep going that way, and bam, you'll end up in this bandit camp. And you use Claptrap's normally right there. Uh, 
yeah, it's, this was pretty easy, guys. But the claptrap, like, as I mean, the toolbox is kind of hard to find. It's up on this pipe, so it's you just gotta figure out a way to get on the pipe, and you should be able to have no trouble with this little mission. But anyway, moving on. Okay, guys. So the next claptrap rescue mission is located in Old Haven, right here on the map. Now, what's different about this is you actually have to, in order for him to appear, you have to complete this quest not without my claptrap i believe it's a uh, part of the main quest in this game so you have to complete that then he'll appear but as you can see i've never done this one here on playthrough one and yeah i quickly complete it but bam that's where he's at and moving on here the next claptrap is located in salt flats uh right here on the map now this one once again is pretty easy to spot especially if you know Going through the main quest here, you just gotta kind of go th over here, and bam, claptrap is right there. Um, and after you uh, obtain his obtain his little uh, repair kit, I always forget what it's called. His repair kit, uh, he will open this little uh, hut up here, and bam, there is a red chest that you can open up and enjoy all the loot that's inside. But okay, that's getting weird. Anyway, moving on. Alrighty, broskies. So the tenth. Uh, Claptrap Rescue Mission is located right here in the Crimson Fastness. Super duper easy to spot. You basically have to spot it because you've got to go through here during the main quest. So you're going to have to pass up cl this Claptrap anyway. So it's like, he's basically in your way. Um, and what's really cool about this one is once you finish the little quest, it'll open up this little room that contains two red chests and a few lockers. So that's definitely really cool. But anyway, moving on. Okay, so the next Claptrap Rescue Mission is located in the Lumber Yard, uh, as you can see right there. But I forgot to mention, guys, there is more than 10 total uh, Claptrap Rescue Missions because uh, I didn't realize it didn't include the DLC. So there's actually three more um, if you include the DLC. So a total of like 13. Um, but anyway, yeah, this one's this one's pretty cool. I've never known about this one until like recently. Just like the Crazy Hero one is really cool. If you do the little quest, it'll take you over here and like. Yeah, there's like this chest will slide down and stuff. It's really cool. But uh, anyway, moving on. Okay, so the twelfth claptrap rescue mission is located in Lockdown Palace, which is in the Secret Armory of General Knox DLC. As you can see right there, um, this one's definitely really easy to spot, guys. You have to go through Lockdown Palace. Um, you know, if you're going through the main quest on this DLC, eventually you go through Lockdown Palace, and he's right there. Super easy to spot. But anyway, once you Complete his little quest, he'll come over here and open this door, which contains a chest, and then he'll go back out and he'll like go under this magnet and he'll get sucked up and stuff, and it's it's really funny. As you can see, he's right there, guys. But look at this. I shoot him, and he goes down, and he's like doing this little dance, and he goes all of a sudden goes back up. And it's it just kill me. Yeah, it's it's crazy, guys. I don't know what happened right there. It was a little glitch, and it was just funny, so funny to me. But anyway. Moving on to the last Claptrap Rescue Mission location. Okay guys, so this is it. The final Claptrap Rescue Mission location right here in Tartarus Station. Uh, which is in the Claptrap Robo Revolution DLC. Now this is not your average Claptrap Rescue Mission. It's, it's actually a trap clap. <laughs> That's actually what the mission's called. And the Claptrap's right here. You get his a uh, little repair kit, give it to him, and his minions come out, robot minions, try to kill you, kill them, you come in here, turn the mission in, and bam, there's also red chest, and look at this, I opened it on in playthrough one here, and I get the hammer, legendary shotgun, it's crazy, am I right guys, really crazy, um, playthrough one too, it's really, really crazy, but, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, um, I hope you guys successfully, you know, finished all these claptrap uh, rescue missions and get all the SDUs max out your inventory space and stuff but um anyway see you bros later Peace.